recreation are an important part of our allocation. So from gardens and playgrounds to quality footpaths, sporting fields, uh, these are the things that make the Holland such a family friendly and active place to live. So here we are in this lovely park here in Springshaw and one of the things in our budget is $290,000 to build some new dog parks. Um, each one for here and one for Ralston. We really need these dog parks. The kids have nowhere to take them with, without running over a road or something. So it's a safety, good safety, safety aspect for the kids as well. And, and the travellers, we get so many of them through here now that, um, and everyone has their fur baby with them. So it's nice to have a really, we can now promote ourselves as having um, areas for them to stop and have their pets stretch their legs as well as the adults. Each year, Council commits part of our budget to repair, replace and extend our footpath network across the region. Some examples of what is in this year's budget are in Emerald, Andrews Road, Pilot Farm Road and Hospital Road, in Blackwater, Mackenzie Street and in Springshaw as part of our beautification planning. Also in our smaller communities as part of our beautification work, we will be doing footpath works in Dingo, Bluff, Capella, Rolston, Anarchy and Ruby Vale. Parks and gardens are offering a cultural experience to the people of Blackwater and, and the Central Islands community. Parks and gardens are spending over 700,000 in developing these, these gardens, uh, which are uh, indigenous type gardens. Um, these will include the medicine type plants and food plants uh, for everyone to learn about those, those plants which are very important to these cultures. Thank you for putting your trust in us. Uh, these are difficult times and these have been hard decisions for Council to make. This budget is balanced, um, it's affordable, uh, importantly it's deliverable and we can't wait to get cracking on it. So if you want to know which part of the budget you'd like to know more about, uh, get on the Central Highlands Regional Council website and let's find out what's happening in your community.